welcome to Horsehead Bookends for another Gaming Friday. Today we are going to be doing an unboxing on an upgrade for a 2017 game that came out and that is Catacombs and Castle. Catacombs and Castles is almost something like a re-implementation of the game Catacombs, which is probably one of my favorite dexterity games, where it is a bunch of, I guess you can say dungeon hunters going after a main boss. It is usually a one versus many type of dexterity flicking game where you have different um, shots and spells and things like that to try to take over uh, and defeat the uh, dungeon boss per the level. And as you go through the levels, you get upgraded and things like that. What Catacombs and Castles did was they made it a two to eight player skirmish style game with a lot of the characters from Catacombs and lots of the different shots and play styles of Catacombs but they kind of made it just a little easier because catacombs can get a little heavy with some of the rules but it's fun nonetheless so anyway the original game which i'll show you uh right now because this box is actually extremely large the original box is only this big very tiny uh and it has all the information in it and the maps in here are just cardboard however they did add these uh, big neoprene mats, which are very nice, uh, but they're very large and they're hard to fit anywhere. So hopefully we'll see if maybe they redid the mats for the, the bigger box, but I'm not sure. So we're going to open up and check it out. Also, we have uh, the Catacombs red box that was part of this, which adds some extra uh, pieces for a Catacombs game. And I'm sure it can be incorporated into Catacombs and Castles. So let's open the box and check it out. All right, so here we have Catacombs Red Box and Catacombs and Castles. Let's open up the Red Box first and see what's in there. Okay, we got a bunch of the wooden discs for Catacombs that do need to get stickers put on them. We have, this looks like a gate of some sort. It's a pretty cool obstacle. Two big chips. Cards, which are probably the player cards and treasure cards. And probably some monster cards. Yep, there's monster cards as well. Ooh, dice. Hmm, that's... All right, we got some uh, new reference sheets for catacombs. Shows you all the different uh, shot types. Oh, there's a grapple. Hmm. That's must, is that new? We have the instructions. We have some sticker sheets for the catacombs, the wooden discs. And then we have some cardboard, uh, Tokens. Oh, that lo this looks really interesting. Uh, how? What this? What's in this red box? I really can't wait to get this um, put into my regular catacombs game. Okay, let's box this up. All right, let's open up this big box and see what's inside. We got new instructions, Ooh, new keystone keeps, that is an expansion for Catacombs and Castles which I have, Siege Defender, uh, these are some of the uh, tiles that go in the pit, there's actually holes in the mat, we got some new stickers for some of the new, uh, I'm sure there's wooden tokens in there. We got some cardboard tokens. Oh, we do have a, looks like a neoprene mat. We will open that up in a second. We have some cards, which are really nice. A 
And here we have some, I guess these are some, these are the actually plastic standees for the walls. These are walls that you build all around your, um, your playboard. And we have some more tokens. So it's, uh, it, it actually looks really cool. Oh, and I think this is the slot for your, um, for your mat. It's a little snug. It kind of bows out the box, but it is just neoprene, so it should fit. Let's see what, uh, let's check out the mats. Oh, see, I see what they did. They're actually, they cut the mat in two, so you have two different sections and you can piece them together. That's pretty nice. I mean, it's not as nice as some of the huge mats that, that I have, but this is pretty cool that it actually has the holes and you, this is where you put those, um, This is where the pit things would fall. So it looks like that when you set up the game. So it's very cool. All right, nice. Let's, uh, let's attempt to get this all back in the box. All right, so that was uh, Catacombs and Castles from Eldred Games. Now, this is not the complete version of it that I got through Kickstarter. This is actually, I think it's called the Huntress Upgrade. It just upgrades my original box that I uh, have already because I have the majority of the game. Now, I really like the way it's organized. Catacombs did this a while ago for uh, to organize all their components for the games because it is a lot. You do have a lot of wooden discs. The only thing I really don't care for is the uh, neoprene mats because they are they kind of bulge out the side of the cardboard box a little uh, to wrap them up I wish they would give them a little more space I might actually take them out and keep them separate but maybe I'll just keep them with these mats because uh, I kind of wish they made these a little smaller but I understand why they have these giant um, play mats for the main game uh, I just wish it kind of fit in the box I, I hate leaving them out on the side but it is what it is so I am super excited I need to get all of the little box I need to get all of this into all of this uh, and see uh, how it gets organized and what it looks like and if it's easy to get uh, get out and set up and play uh, organization for games especially for to speed up set up and breakdown time is uh, usually really high on my list of likes when it comes to certain board games just because uh, if you can set up and break down quickly it gives you more time to play other games so I'm really happy about this I can't wait to uh, sort it out and get it to the table so if you like the video please give it a thumbs up also please don't forget to click on subscribe and the notification bell you get notified anytime I upload a new video questions or comments feel free to post them below and I'll get back to you as soon as possible otherwise talk to you later